Hey everybody, welcome back to Strapped for Cash. Um, my name is Brenna. I'm a 34 year old uh, cash stuffer um, and budgeter. And uh, today um, we are going to stuff my husband's paycheck, his second paycheck for the month of April. Um, and we're going to stuff our bills, our sinking funds, and my wallet for the week. So uh, if that interests you, let's uh, go ahead and get into it. Uh, today was the first week back from vacation um, for us, so we didn't. We did a big grocery run um, last weekend, but other than that, we haven't really bought a whole heck of a lot. I think I spent ten dollars out of my wallet this week, um, so there's not much, um, not much out of here, which is nice. Which means we'll have more money for our denomination savings challenges. Um, and no change. Like I, I literally, I bought nothing. <laughs> I think I got ten dollars to buy sushi, um, and I gave it to my coworker. So that was all we had. Um, so for eating out, looks like we have a twenty left. Our household expenses, we did nothing, so we have a ten. And I didn't, I didn't spend anything, you guys. <laughs> so spending, I have a five. So. That's awesome, we have $35 going into our denomination challenges. Um, so I'm just gonna set this off to the side over here so that we don't get it mixed up like I did um, a couple weeks ago. Um, so today we are stuffing um, a total of $15.33 minus the $185 that we keep in the bank for our gas and groceries. Um, so we're gonna put the $45 um, for spending, eating out, and our household expenses into my wallet today. Um, so spending is gonna go ahead and get a five, which one day I'll update this. So spending is gonna get a five. Eating out is going to get 30. I'm gonna try and find the yucky ones. I don't know. Let's see. No. And a 10 for eating out. And our household expenses also gets a 10. I don't think that we're really needing a whole heck of a lot right now. So I'm hoping I can just um, next week, next Friday, um, when I get paid, maybe we can switch those out again. So that's it for my wallet. Not a very exciting wallet thing today but that's all right so um now we're gonna go ahead and get into our bills um they're the the same as they always are um and this is getting very very full so i'm i don't know i don't know if i should do something different with this you know i think they alternate as far as the zippers go i don't know should i go to zipper list i've looked into them um, or, you know, like the laminated ones that, a uh, that a lot of people have. Um, I, I don't know if I'm just really paranoid about it falling out. It's not like I carry this around, so does it matter? Probably not. Um, but this is just getting to be a little, a little much just for the magnet. Um, so I don't know if, if you guys use the laminated ones or like the same zipper material, but zipper lists, I know they have them on Amazon and you like them. Let me know. I I don't really want to spend a lot more money, but I will if it's going to maintain the integrity of my binders, I guess, for a long time because I don't really I don't really want to replace these very often if I can help it. Um, so anyway, let's go ahead and get into it. Um, our mortgage, I, like I said, this is the my second my husband's second paycheck of the month, which is our third paycheck of the month overall. Um, mine will be at the end of the month. Um, so it's just, it's getting to be a lot when I divide all of our, um, bills in, in a quarter, basically. So I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. I've got a lot of really crispy fives, so I'm going to try and get the more crappier ones for bills, um, just so that we can keep the really nice crisp ones. So <clears throat> for our mortgage today, we're gonna add 315. So let's see if we can. That 
that in here. So now for our mortgage for April so far, we have one, two, three, four hundred, five, six, seven, eight, nine hundred. Oh my goodness. Nine hundred, ten, twenty, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five. Nine hundred and forty-five. So three quarters of the way there. Let's see. Utilities today is getting 97. So we'll go 50, 220, 90. I said I wanted to get the yucky ones. Five. I don't know how you guys make this look so effortless. Six, seven. Okay, let's count these up now. We have 51, 50. So we have 120, 40, 60, 80, 200, 50, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91. So 291, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> so 291. I'll just leave this. So that is nice. Um, this is another month. May will be, because we're saving for May's bills. May is another month that I don't have to pay my trash, which is fully budgeted every month my mistake. So we're going to take another extra hundred of this um, at the end of the month and put it toward our debt, which is really exciting. Um, subscriptions is getting 34. Four. So let's see, 34. So we'll go 20. Okay, so now in our monthly subscriptions, we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 100, 101, 102. So 102 in subscriptions, our monthly subscriptions. Put that in the front. And then for our yearly subscriptions, our annual subscriptions, we're getting a five in there. I did condense this a little bit when I was um, doing some unstuffing for uh, expenses. So this isn't as, as thick as it was last week. Um, there's the same amount in there, there's just not as many bills. So now for yearly subscriptions, I think our target is like $202 or something like that. So whatever. Um, so yearly subscriptions now has 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52. 52. Uh, Verizon uh, is getting 32 today. 30. I keep getting text messages from Verizon. I mean, it seems like almost at least once a week offering me, um, you know, upgrades to my phone if, if I add another line or, you know, something like that. And it's just like, I'm not, I'm not going to do it guys. Um, so anyway, Verizon has 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 96 dollars. Farmers, which is our car insurance, is getting 43. So one, two, two, three. So now Farmers has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So 129. Um, our truck payment is getting 39, 30, 
six, seven, eight, nine. So now our truck payment has 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, five, six, seven, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So 117. And this is the payment that gets the extra money for Snowball. Um, my car payment, it's 126. 25, 26. So now my car payment has 1, 2, 300. 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78. Yeah, 378. Okay, um, our line of credit that we took out on the house to remodel is getting 97. So 50, 90. 90, where is it? Five, six, seven. Okay, so now it has 51, 20, 40, 60, 82, 50, so 250, 270, 275, 280, 285, 286, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 291. It's actually really nice because the home line of credit and the total utilities, like my combined utilities, are the same amount. So I know if I screw it up on one, because um, the other one will tell me. So those will always be the same, which is nice. Okay, so our credit cards, these are a combined payment between my husband and myself, gets 188. So 150, 70, 80. Five, six, and eight. Okay. So harder, not harder, Brenna. There we go. Okay. So now um, our combined credit card payments have, this is just like minimum payments, um, are 100, 2, 3, 50, 4, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 5, 550, 555, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, so I think it was 594. which kind of tracks. I think the total, it's not necessarily minimum payments because we are, we're, go, we're going over, we budgeted for over whatever the minimum payment was when we first started paying these, like for budgeting for these. So <clears throat> obviously your minimum payment on your credit card fluctuates if you use it, right? Or even as it goes down, it fluctuates. Um, so we're not adjusting our budget for whatever the actual minimum payment is. Um, like we're budgeting for $300 on my husband's credit card and 450 on mine. So the past couple months, 450 has been um, over my minimum. So it kind of works as a snowball itself, I guess a little bit, but we're not really, we're not being super duper precise as far as like lowering that amount so that'll always stay constant um that's kind of my plan for our snowball is that 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 minimum is um always constant on those so anyway for um my husband's roth um we are doing 13. so now he has um 10 20 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. So I think 
I screwed up last time, um, and I, I think I did, instead of a quarter payment, I ended up doing like an eighth of a payment, um, so I don't think, I'm trying to do math here, I, I know, yeah, I didn't correct it on this one, but I, as I was kind of pre-planning for my paycheck uh, next week, I did over budget, I'm um, not over budget, but I budgeted extra for the Roth to make up. So we have that full $50 um, payment for him. So um, we'll, we'll catch that one up. Um, and then our extra debt for a snowball for the truck gets the last hundred. And we now have 300 of the 400. So that is good. So that is, like I, I look at this thing, it's just like, it's not gonna close. I gotta figure out something else. So seriously, let me know what you guys think. Um, oh, it did, finally it did. But it's it's about to burst. So let me know what you guys uh, think about those zipperless ones or the, um, oh gosh, the laminated ones. Um, so yeah, let me know. So this now has 300. Okay, so moving on into our sinking funds binders. Um, we're gonna start out with our black binder, which is our revolving, I forgot to add my totals in here. Ugh. You know what, I'll do it after. It's more of a challenge for me to count correctly, I guess. Um, so we're gonna start off with my husband and I's um, spending um, envelopes. So Hogan is getting $10. So now Hogan has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 71, 2, 3, and 4. 174. Yeah, 174. So good for him. Um, in my personal spending, I also get $10. And now I have 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53. So 153. So 153. Um, our pets today are getting 20. This is needed. The dogs need dog food. Cats need cat litter. It's never ending. Um, so our pets today now have 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98. So 198 dollars. That's awesome. Um, I really want this to be, I don't know if I should kind of have it separated out. When we get to a certain amount, I would like to have like, I don't know, like three to $500 in like emergency, like vet bill type, um, type thing, just kind of set aside, <clears throat> excuse me. And then on top of that, you know, we'll have our revolving amount, you know, that we use for, for food and uh, treats and you know all their fun stuff so eventually we'll get this one beefed up enough for that but that's my ultimate goal groceries is getting 10 was that already open if it was groceries is getting a 10 so groceries now has 150 60 70 80 80 182 so 182 Gas is also getting a 10, and it has $220. I've not really had to use any of that, so that's really exciting. Our household expenses are getting not, did I just not close these last time? I don't know, $9. 
so five, six, seven, eight, nine. So yeah, that used up my ones. So now our household expenses has 51, five, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 100, Seventeen dollars in household expenses. Eating out is getting ten dollars. Is that all I get? Huh. I thought I would have put more, but we have ten dollars in there now. Um, and now it has fifty, seventy, ninety, one ten, one twenty, one thirty, one forty. Uh, miscellaneous is getting skipped today. It should still have a hundred. I guess I can count it for you guys. I know some people like every single one counted. Um, so yeah, so 50, 70, 90, 95, 100. So I think that one's, that one's just fine for now. I'm not going to stress on that one. Just add 100 right there. Family funds getting $5. So now Family Fund has 100, 10, 20, 25, 26, 27. 127. Ooh. And then prescriptions. Oh man, there is a big storm coming in. So you guys might get to hear some thunder. Prescriptions. I don't know what I just did. Okay. Oh my goodness. Butterfingers. Prescriptions now has 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 66. So I think my husband took stuff out and didn't log it or didn't tell me to, so that's typical. Uh, do you guys struggle with that? Like, my husband will be like, okay, I need to go get my prescriptions, and I'll be like, okay, go get it out of your envelope, you know? But... <laughs> And the reason he doesn't write it down is because I'm really anal retentive about how my log sheets look. And Hogan, I love you, but you and I both know you don't have the best handwriting. Um, so, um, you know, I think, you know, I probably could have also remembered to go upstairs and, and fix it, but whatever. So I'll just fix it in a minute. It's not a big deal but we, we catch ourselves a lot with that. Um, anyway, so travel today is gonna get a 10, and now it has $500 in the bank, six, seven, 800, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70. So $870. Car maintenance, car maintenance is getting 10 also. Okay. So now car maintenance has $500 in the bank, 6, 7, 800, 50, 70, 90, 9, 10, 9, 20, 9, 30, is that right? Yeah, 9, 30. So that is exciting. We are $70 away from my goal, and then we can leave that one alone until we need it. Um, medical today is getting just five. So now it has 500 in the bank, six, 605. Dental is also getting five. My youngest son had a dentist appointment scheduled a couple weeks ago and on it was on Good Friday. Um, and then they called like two hours before his appointment to move it out. So we're not going again until May, I think. I think it was May. So whatever. Um, so anyway, so now dental with the five we added has one, two, three, 20, 40, 45, 50, 55. So 
for 355 which is nice. Home renovations. This is an important one. Summer's almost here. We got a lot of plans. It's getting 20. So home renovation says $500 in the bank. There's six, 650, 670, 690, 710, 730, 740. I don't really, I don't know how much we're gonna need. We need a new front door. We need a new back door. We have this, um, it's really nice, but it's like a little bay window or whatever that um, is in our kitchen that is leaking. So we probably need a new window. It's just, it's never ending, you guys. I don't know. Um, our emergency fund is getting $10. And we have 1,500 in the bank, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70 here. So we have 15, 70. Uh, our new camper is getting skipped today because we sold our existing camper. Oh, it just got so dark, you guys. Um, so sorry about the lighting. It just got terrible. Um, but we sold our previous camper, the one that we just had. Um, and so we are going to be buying my coworkers camper um, for actually less than what we sold our camper for plus this 805. So we're gonna have money left over, so yay. Um, I think what we'll probably end up doing is I'll make a new envelope um, and change where it's at. Um, I'll take it out of this binder um, but we will use the remaining money toward, well, I don't know. I mean, I guess it, I'm undecided. Shocking. Um, so I'll either make a new envelope just for like camping, um, you know, cause we're going to have to rent and reserve camping spaces and that's going to cost us some money. Um, or I'll just combine that in our family fund envelope that we already have. Um, so I don't know. We'll see, but exciting stuff. I'm really excited that it's, we're not, um, that we're well within, you know, our budget for our new camper. I'm super excited. So, um, camper is getting skipped. Tech is getting skipped. Um, well, I guess I can put this down. So we had 805 in here and tech has 760. Um, month ahead is also getting skipped. Sorry, I didn't mean to bump you. It has 536 in it. Okay, so now our moms are getting their usual five. It ones, it does have ones. So now the moms have 20, 40, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70. 70 bucks for the momsers. Okay, so that does it for our long-term binder. Um, and we will move on to the boys' binder. I am really sorry about the lighting, you guys. It is about to just absolutely pour with rain. Um, so it could get loud. You might get a little uh, Midwest thunderstorm in your video today. That's exciting. Um, Harrison, his savings is going to get five. I've kind of just made the decision that each paycheck they're going to get five bucks um if we have you know bonus paychecks or you know something fun going on um then maybe they'll get more um but i think for our everyday checks for right now they're going to get five dollars so that that way they should be consistently getting twenty dollars a month which i think is sufficient for kids in elementary school they don't really get an allowance unless um you know, uh, they do extra chores or something, then we give them money, but right now, this is what they're getting. So, um, now with that five added, Harrison has 150, 55, 60, 65, 70, 71, 2, 3, 4, 5. So that was 100, 
75. Okay, yeah, it's a good thing I have a 175. I don't know how some of these budgeters and stuffers do it without like looking in and double checking these all the time. I am just not good at counting money, I guess. Um, which is kind of ironic because, fun fact, when I was, um, my first job in high school was a teller. <laughs> so you'd think I'd be better at this, but I'm just not. Um, so $5 in Harrison's College Fund. He now has 100, 200, 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 120, or sorry, 225. Okay, Benson is also getting five and his just saving savings. Okay, so now he has, should be the same as Harrison, hopefully. Um, he has 150, 60, 65, 70, 71, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 175. Benson's College is also getting five. So now Benson's College has one, two, five. Oh my gosh, these are so sticky. 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. So 225. Uh, the Boys Christmas is getting five. So now in their Christmas fund, they have 100, 200, 50, 70, 80, 85, 90. So 290. Really excited about that. And clothing is getting skipped today. They have 110. Their birthdays. They are getting five. So in birthdays, they have 100, 200, 20, 30, 35, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. So 245. Um, let's see, sports is getting five. We had to pay for um, Benson's soccer team photos, so we did have to take that out. Uh, it was $27, that was insane. Um, so now in sports, they have 100, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, $128. Uh, school fees is getting five dollars. Um, I need to take some money out of here for a book that Kozar, our, our uh, one of our Goldens, ate as library book from the school. So we had to pay them. So this ten dollars is going away real quick. Um, but in school fees, we have one hundred twenty, twenty-five, thirty, one hundred and thirty. So way to go, Kozar, for doing that. And so that does it for the kiddos. And last but not least, we have this, I don't know, I call it the flower binder. It's not even flowers on it. I have no idea what you call this. Um, but it's our random things we don't know what to, to do with in another category <laughs> binder. Um, so gym equipment and resin are not getting stuff today, but I'll go ahead and add those in. 156. And my resin gets 154. Um, speaking of resin, I went ahead and used one of my little coasters today. Can you tell I'm a boy mom with my Minecraft cup? Um, but yeah, this is I make these kinds of coasters. Um, this is just honestly just like a random design that I poured, but 
sorry about the condensation in there too, but um, this is the kind of stuff I make on my Etsy in case you guys were curious. Um, not plugging necessarily, but um, that is what that is, what I do normally. Um, so birthdays, so this is for everyone but the kids. I'm getting a five, now it has 100, 200, 5, 10, 15. So 215. And then Christmas is also getting a five. And now Christmas for everyone but the kids has 100, 200, 50, 60. Yeah, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75. So 275. Let's see, Mother's Day and Father's Day has 100, but it is getting skipped today. Um, our anniversary, our 10 year anniversary is coming up this year. It is getting the last 10. Um, and so now it has $500 in the bank, 50, 70, 80, 90, 110, or sorry, 610, 600 with the five. So 610, so that's really exciting. Probably at this point, only enough for a hotel. <laughs> so we gotta keep plugging away at that one. Um, and then gifts, this is just random gifts. Um, it has 50 in it, but we are skipping it today. Um, and then that brings us to our denomination challenges. We have no, no ones today to put in. So we'll skip our ones, we'll put in our five. And as usual, we're not gonna count it. We're just gonna wait. And then we get to put in our first 10. So that's exciting. Tens are usually the first thing that I try and break, so I don't usually have a lot of tens. And then our first 20. So that is really exciting. So now we got everything represented. Um, and then unique bills. I just use um, like $2 bills. I have, I'll show you guys, why not, right? I have one $2 bill from Intentional Living when I bought a little, uh, one of those little red binders that she uses for her um, Europe savings challenges. I got one of those thinking I might use that for like these like leftover bills, but I haven't yet. So I'm not really sure what, um, what I'm going to use it for, but I wanted to make sure that I snagged one before she went out of, um, out of stock again. So I have my $2 bill from her. Um, I thought this was kind of unique. So it looks like the the print die for the dollar was off. Um, so I'm sure it's not really valuable, but it's kind of funny looking. So um, I kept that one. And then I think the rest are just star notes. Um, you know, why not? Fun things for the kids to, to look at when they're older, or, you know, who knows? So I just keep those in here because they're fun. I don't count them toward our totals. So anyway, that is it today, guys. Uh, thank you so much for staying to the end of the video if you uh, stayed. Um, I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome weekend. And uh, we'll see you next week. Thanks. Bye, guys.